Hey guys, welcome back to Bronson's Math Club. Today's topic is what is a percentage? This topic is all about percentages, okay? So let's look at um, rule number one, and it says that a percentage is a number out of 100, okay? So what they mean by that is, so let's say we have 12, and 12 is a percentage, okay? So, and another thing to remember is that a percentage is represented by this symbol over here. It's like kind of like slash with two dots, okay? So 12% is 12 out of 100. So this is how you turn a, a percentage into a fraction. To do this, you'll have to put the number as a numerator in your fraction, okay? And the denominator is going to be 100 since we're trying to represent 12 out of 100, okay? So 12% represented as a fraction is going to be 12 out of 100. Now let's learn to make the 12% into a decimal. To do this, first you have to uh, make it into a fraction. So we know that 12% made into a fraction is going to be 12 out of a 100, okay? Now to turn this into a decimal, what we need to do is divide the 12 by 100. So we're gonna write 12, okay? And we're gonna divide it by 100, but why do we have to do that? When we can, all we have to do is take the decimal point, okay? Count the number of zeros 100 as, and obviously it's gonna be two, so it's always gonna be two. So we're going to move the decimal point two spaces to the left, okay, since we're dividing. So two spaces move to the left. So uh, 12 is going to become 0 0.12. So 12% 12 made into a decimal is going to be 0 0.12, okay? So now let's take this example over here. So now let's say I have a huge pizza okay I have this pizza and this is exactly 100 percent okay so this is exactly 100 slices all over okay and I want to take again 12 percent of this 100 percent pizza to do this first let's make this 100 percent pizza into a half so I'm gonna cut it into half that's gonna make it 50% on one side and another 50% on the other. Okay. Now let's cut it. Um, let's um slice it up more. So now we have it in uh for uh quarts. Okay. I mean uh we have it in fourths. So this is 25% each. Okay. We have 25% in each of my fourths, okay? So now let's take this one block and let's uh, further slice it up, okay? So now we have 13% and 12% since we're actually trying to find 12%, okay? So 12% of this 100% Pizza is going to be, let me get my pencil real quick. Okay, so 12% of this 100% pizza is going to be this portion, and the rest of the 88% is going to be this portion right here. Okay, so now that we know what really goes on behind the scenes of a, a percent. Uh, turning into a fraction okay now let's move on so now let's say that we have okay so now let's say that we have 5 15 actually 15 percent of 400 okay so we have 15 percent of 400 so this time we have a percentage and we have to find the percentage out of a number okay so this number is going to be 400 now the first thing you have to do is you have to um, make this into a mathematical problem. So it's going to be 15%, right? So 15%, first you have to make this into a, a, a fraction, right? So 15% turned into a fraction is going to be 15 out of 100, okay? And then what you're doing is, is since it's 15% of 400, what we're going to be doing is multiplying by 400, 
okay so 400 uh, is actually a whole number you if you want you can also put a one underneath it to um uh, make it into a fraction if it's easier for you that way okay so what we're going to be doing is simply multiplying okay so 15 times 400 is going to give us six wait i'm sorry i'm writing six it, it, this is going to give us 60 um uh so 15 times 4 is going to be 60 and plus those two zeros and we're going to get 6000 okay and then we know that 100 times 1 is going to be 100 so uh, remember to um bring that 100 back so now we do um, now we're dividing 60 uh, 6000 by 100 so 6000 divided by 100 is going to give us so we cut out the two zeros from both of these answers so this is the one way that I like to do the best and you get 660 or divided by 1 and we know that is 60 so 15 percent of 400 is going to give us 60 now let's do another problem over here so now let's say that we have 5 percent of 80 okay so again first you have to make the percent into a fraction so 5 percent made into a fraction is going to be 5 out of 100 okay and then we have to multiply that by 80 again you can have a 1 underneath the number okay so now we have to do is all we have to do is multiply so 5 times 8 is going to give us 40 and plus that 1 0 so 400 and then remember 100 times 1 is going to give us 100 and then we divide 400 divided by 100 is going to give us 4 and so we know that 5% of 80 is 4 so that's all we have for today. Um, stick around for more videos and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.